Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. Today's video is another filthy house clean with me. I have tons of extreme all day cleaning motivation and I also have a ton of laundry motivation. Drop me some sunshine emojis if you are having a great day and you are ready to clean with me. I'll be starting off this filthy house clean with me with some laundry motivation. Laundry piled up on me so I have about three hampers to sort through in this filthy house clean. I'll be sorting, washing, and folding laundry. I like to sort my laundry by texture, material, and color. After I sort through the laundry, I'll be taking the laundry hampers downstairs to throw the clothing in the washer. Let me know what your laundry routine is like down in the comments. Are you a load a day type of person or are you like me and you let the laundry pile up and knock it all out in one setting? If this is your first time visiting my channel, hello and welcome. My name is Ryan Michelle. On my channel, I create cleaning and laundry motivational videos, organization, decluttering, and home decor inspiration. So if you like content like that and you like watching cleaning videos, this is the place to be. I really hope you consider subscribing and joining my family. I am a military wife and a stay-at-home mom of four. We are getting ready to move to Germany over the summertime and I will have tons of new content to be posted. I do have a vlogging channel so if you haven't already go ahead and head over there and subscribe to my vlogging channel. It's linked in my description box. Next I will be starting my load of laundry and I always use my go-to Tide detergent. Y'all I did pick up some new detergent so I cannot wait to share what detergent that I picked up with you guys and I also picked up some dryer sheets I still haven't found any new dryer balls yet but yeah for my laundry day I do use Tide laundry sanitizer and vinegar this is the before of my filthy living room I am going to go ahead and get it all nice and clean Lauren is up there in her high chair eating her breakfast but yeah I was cleaning all day and I have tons and tons of cleaning motivation for you guys if you are already getting a ton of cleaning and laundry motivation please don't forget to like this video liking my videos help out my channel so much I'm also going to tackle my TV stand in this video guys it is so much clutter and paper in my TV stand so it was much needed but yeah I'm gonna let the music play I truly hope you guys enjoy the playlist and let me know down in the comment section if you did or if you are enjoying the playlist let me know but yeah back to cleaning without you So because the coffee table was so filthy, I did spray it down with the Comet All-Purpose Cleaner and now I'm going to go behind it with the glass cleaner from Dollar Tree. So next I'm going to tackle my TV stand. This has become another catch-all zone and I cannot stand that. I really just like to see spaces just clear of clutter. 
clutter just stresses me out and gives me some extreme anxiety you guys let me know in the comment section if you are the same or do you not mind seeing the clutter some spaces i can deal with and then some spaces i just can't deal with so i want to wipe down my tv stand with the comment cleaner and i really think the comment cleaner is all that i used in this video the comment cleaner was almost gone so i did have to put some water in it and um kind of like refill the bottle so it'll spray correctly but yes i am using the comic cleaner and i picked that cleaner up from dollar tree and now i'm just going to go through and get rid of some of this paper and clutter and junk in my tv stand because it was a mess the bins that i will be using were upstairs i did shop my home with some bins i already had and these bins are from dollar tree i'm not too crazy about the colors but i just made it work i will eventually get some more bins and then on the side of the tv I did have that basket I don't know if you have already watched but my last video I did like refresh and transform my living room and I used the basket for my plant that I had over here so it's in the other room but I don't really have um, anything to put the cords in over here in the corner anymore so I'm just going to collect all of the cords and put them inside of the TV stand in one of those bins and then I'll be spraying down that area because it was extremely dusty and filthy back here Boy, it's been a while since we talked And my head's getting nervous I can handle this on and off I can't know I just gotta know where you are If I want to remain sane But you go send every text and call Oh no You could be running off with somebody else So this TV stand has so much paperwork in here. Everything that comes out of my kids' book bag and their folders, their classwork, projects, everything. I am so guilty of just stuffing it all in the TV stand and then I will tell myself I'll come back to it later, I'll clean it later, and I never come back to it. So that's how I have collected all of this just junk in my TV stand. Let me know down in the comments what is an area that you need to seriously declutter. I know I still have many areas around my home that I need to declutter. So I will be tackling that up until the time that it's time for us to move. And y'all, it's going to come so fast. So y'all, please bear with me if I'm not able to upload a video some weeks or I'm just uploading one video a week. Y'all, please just bear with me because it's about to get so busy and hectic around here with the whole moving process. I can't wrap my head around it You said you and I were meant to be Last week You could be running off with somebody else Ooh, boy, I ask myself Yeah, we maybe you're just off doing what you said Ooh, I think I've lost myself Tell me what's the hold up I'll finish with the TV stand and next up I'm just going to swap out the little rolling thing I don't know what the name of that is but I swapped it out so we can like pick up all of the dirt on my area rug and I always get questions about this area rug this area rug is from at home the at home store that store is super huge and they do have um, everything online as well I will link it down in my description box but that basket that you guys saw right there on the corner I do use that basket when I'm cleaning downstairs to just put everything that is not supposed to be downstairs in that basket so I can just easily take it all back upstairs and put it to or put it in its normal spot Take it away, take it away, feeling too good to me 
chilling all day, all in your space is where I wanna be. Here in this room, what did you do? I just can't get enough. Too caught up in your love. So next up, I'm just gonna go ahead and fold this load of laundry. Um, I still have so much more cleaning motivation for you guys, but I'm gonna stop and give you some more laundry motivation. I will be tackling my downstairs area in this video, so I have so many more areas to get clean. Nothing seems to work on you. Yeah, you, you always make I wish I could have just folded the laundry over on my washing machine, but it was way too many clothes, so I couldn't do that. That's why I chose to do it right here, standing, but I chose to stand and fold because Lauren, I had to like guard my clothes because as you've seen, she was pulling the clothes off of the couch onto the floor, and now she has like one of my rags that were just washed, and she is wiping the table down over here, y'all. Too caught up in your love I've been trying to forget But you won't let me Something in my brain holds you I've been hanging by myself Asking for help But nothing seems to work on you So let me know down in the comment section what are you doing while you are watching are you cleaning along are you doing laundry or are you just watching let me know down in the comment section So after I switch over this load of laundry, I will be tackling my eating area. The eating area was not too bad and I didn't really get too many before and after clips in this video. I don't know why, maybe because I was just rushing because I had Lauren on my heels. I don't know, but I hope you guys can understand. But this video is still packed with tons and tons of cleaning motivation and laundry motivation. Let me know, do you guys like laundry motivation in each video? or do you just like videos just strictly just only laundry let me know let me know and also what videos would you like me to create for the month of april and the month of may So the eating area can get pretty filthy over here. So I really try to stay on top of wiping the table down. I like to wipe it down after each meal, but my kids, they go to school in classrooms. So I really don't have to worry about any meals other than breakfast and dinner. And then dinner, my oldest, she takes care of the eating area during that time. So I only just have to focus on after breakfast because my kids are gone all day. And my daughter, my youngest, she doesn't eat over here. Lauren eats at her high chair or her little table. So it's really not too bad throughout the day other than after breakfast. But my area, this eating area can get pretty bad over here. And I really try to keep the floor swept because um, yeah, it's pretty filthy. Now underneath the table, that can get bad as well. But I really try, I try, try, try to move the table and clean under there once a week because my kids like to throw their food underneath the table. Baby, how did we ever come? 
this way I know you don't want to stay Dream of outer space, keep rushing down the highway Keep yourself busy on a Sunday You keep doing you, I do it my way So now we are moving into the front living room area. It is not too bad, just toys all over the floor as usual. So I'm gonna go ahead and clean up the toys on the floor and then I will be vacuuming this area. See my pillows are not all thrown over the floor as usual. So my kids have been helping me out with keeping my pillows off of the floor and that's always a great thing. Tell me what you like and all your secrets I just want to go over the details Let me inside of your mind I know I just met you But something tells me that you might be into Talking to a stranger with a tattoo Baby, I'm one of a kind There's a reason we're here There's a vibe in the air That I thought you and me could deny well, I see how you stare up and down everywhere I can tell you're far from shy So let's talk till we drop Or till we get kicked out Let's just say what we want So today is also wash day so Lauren's hair is all over the place so y'all please excuse her hair today for this video. It is a hot crazy mess and she is riding out on her little car all in my way but she did have a little fleece cap on because when we take the boys to the bus stop she likes to wear that and when we come inside to take it off she fights me. She does not want to take off the clothes. That sleeper that she has on is something that she wears to the bus stop as well and she will not take it off y'all but i am all done with the front living room it's all nice and clean i did not do too much in here because i just recently deep clean this space so let's talk till we drop or till we get kicked out All right, y'all, now let's tackle this kitchen. It was a hot, filthy mess. So I am going to go ahead, unload this dishwasher. Oh my God, Lauren, hair is looking so crazy right there. But I'm gonna go ahead and unload this dishwasher and wash the dishes that are overflowing in the sink. Clear off the countertops, get those all nice and clean because they are filthy. Sweep the floor and that should be it here in the kitchen if you are still here and watching drop me some green hearts down in the comment section and do not forget to like this video or subscribe if you are new So I have been slacking on the kitchen area. I have been giving myself grace. I will get to these dishes when I get to the dishes. And y'all, I don't even like care. I'll get to it when I get to it. And because I have so much going on and when the house is a total wreck, it's kind of hard to just stay on top of things all the time. And I just give myself grace on a lot of things, but I'm just refilling my soap dispenser with some dish detergent and the name of that dish detergent is the members mark brand from sam's let me know do you shop at sam's or what's another bulk store costco i think kirkland's is a bulk store i'm not really sure we only shop at sam's we have been shopping at sam's forever
always looking for Lawrence cups and when I do find them it has like two week old milk in it and so that's why I sprayed it down with the Dawn power wash and filled it with some water and just shook it up and hopefully it will like uh, loosen up the old milk that's in there and yeah I seriously hate when that happens I'm still trying to figure out the Dawn power wash and y'all I don't know who left that swallow one swallow of sunny d in the refrigerator but i cannot stand when that happens like just finish it and throw it away but <sighs> kids can be so lazy i mean adults we can be lazy too but y'all i cannot stand when that happens that's a pet peeve as well still trying to figure out the dawn power wash spray um yeah it's i don't know it's just I don't know just a, something that you can just buy I guess I mean it's just one of those trendy buys I would say so I'm really not too you know I don't know fascinated with it just yet I'm still trying to figure it out I use it in my sink to clean it out before I wash the dishes I use it on my counters my stove area I mean I feel like it works just as well as method cleaners I guess but yeah maybe I'm just super old school I don't know I just feel like I pretty much could have went without buying it. As I was wiping down the coffee maker, I noticed that the tray needed some serious cleaning. It was filthy, y'all. So I just went ahead and got that all nice and clean. And being that it is a white coffee maker, I really have to stay on top of cleaning it because you can notice and see everything. And with coffee being brown, you can just see it easily. The closet with the garbage can can get pretty filthy in here so I really try to stay on top of cleaning it and sweeping it out 
at least every other day i'm not able to sweep it every day but some days it can get like really really bad this is my um this is my daughter's chore and then my son he likes to help out in here too with taking the boxes out to the recycle bin so i really try to stay on top of that because y'all it can get really bad in that room i've said before in my past videos i really hate that we have a closet for the garbage i wish it could just like stay out in the open and we wouldn't have to worry about the trash all like packed in there on the floor i cannot stand it now i'm just gonna finish off with some folding motivation i truly hope you guys got a ton of cleaning motivation laundry motivation and this video gave you all the motivation that you need to tackle your week also if i don't upload a video and you just need some cleaning motivation you can always come on over to my channel turn on my playlist i have tons and tons of cleaning playlists laundry playlists and other playlists located on my channel and they are always in my description box as well so you can always come clean with me when i don't just upload a new video i know you guys love seeing new content but you can always just turn me on and clean along with me i'm always here if you need some cleaning motivation i hope you guys enjoyed today's video and i will see you guys back on my next one have a great day Feeling like I'm all alone, you don't seem to want me, even though you told me so. And baby, I wonder if we should just go in separate ways. We could start over, we could start over. Trying not to let my feelings get to me, sometimes I can't let them go. So now I got these voices.